what up? Hey there, cool cats. Like and subscribe. You know you wanna. Welcome to my channel. So one thing I would like to tell you is my first passion was education. Since the third grade, education has always been something that I was just so passionate about. If you knew me from my childhood, you knew I made like clothes for like either myself or my dolls or whatever. I just like really like doing that. So you know, sewing was not something I could do once I got to like my 20s. I can't do it now because I just do not have the space for a sewing machine. It's really interesting starting out on this journey that I'm starting out on. I never thought this opportunity would ever come along and here it is. I'm doing what I love for money and actually helping people. You know, I have a lot of clothes that I pick out. There's a lot of clothes that I really can't wear, but I think some people would absolutely love, you know? I'm about to have my YouTube up and running. So now I have to rework things and now I'm about to send it out. You know, you got it? Did you get it? As you know, my name is Cleo De Leo. Why did I pick that name? Let me tell you. Okay. The Cleo part of it. I had Monster High Dolls, okay? I did. In my 20s, I had Monster High Dolls and I loved it. It was the best doll line I could have ever imagined. They had all kinds of sizes. They had backstories. They had all of it. It was perfect. And like, I just loved it. And I still had some of my Barbie clothes. Even if I, like, I discarded my Barbies and I gave it to some other kid, I still kept the clothes because she can just buy more or whatever. And like, I put on my boss of high dolls, I made new clothes for them and stuff. And like, since they was all kind of different, I could just make, like, I can get two Claudines and one could be Samantha, like, you know? So I would just make up different dolls and I had a bunch of them, lost them. But my favorite one that I, I felt like I really identified with, but deep down inside, I'm more like a Cleo a Nile. So I put the Cleo on there and I was like, boom. So. My zodiac sign is Leo. I know, I know. Let me get see. I know. Once, one time I read somewhere that when it comes to Leos, they like animal skin. Mine is tiger, cause um, and plus I like Tigger from Winnie the Pooh. So I like to watch a lot of PBS Kids for obvious reason. And one of the shows I actually really did like was like Daniel Tiger and like the mom or whatever. Tiger mom, like I will do anything for my kid. You touch my cup. I got, I got another one if you want it. I, do you want one? Okay, I was just wondering. My zodiac sign, the Leo part. Earliest childhood memories was Pokemon and um, Wearing like rings all over my fingers. Like I had 10 rings over my fingers. I love that. You know, keepsakes, I guess, I don't know. And then I got some nice pieces and I really like them. And they got symbolism to me. And some of them came from Forever 21 and just like chill out or whatever. I'm in this background and now my other one is because none of this outfit has been, has been thrifted. Nothing that I'm wearing is thrifted. I bought this. And I didn't want to like lie to you because it's like something I'm wearing today. My outfit of the day. I'm about to post what I'm about to have in my Depop. It's going to be the next video. Comment down below what my next video should be. Should I do my favorite thrift, thrifted items? Or should I post it my very, very, very first thrift store video ever recorded back in... Girl, what? Yeah, okay, well it... So you have the option of my very first thrift store ever or my next video should be my favorite thrifted items. So comment down below, hit the subscribe wherever it is, hit the bell icon wherever it is, and hit the like button. Yeah, that one too, everything. Share it with your friends. Also go to my Depop. Look at what I have on my Instagram now, because I be posting stuff. 
I've actually neglected my personal one just to take care of this one. I'm just gonna have to get up. You're just gonna have to see. Maybe leave it at you.